Welcome back. Let us now see how to solve the question number 15 in CKS exam simulator in Killer Shell. So question number 15, task rate 4 percentage. Let's switch to the given context. Uh, in the namespace team-pink, there is an existing Nginx ingress resource named secure, which accepts two paths, slash app and slash API which point to different cluster IP services. From your main terminal, you can connect to it using, for example, and uh, they have given the curl commands to connect to the HTTP and HTTPS endpoints. And right now it uses the default generated TLS certificate by the uh, Nginx ingress controller. You are asked to instead use the key and the certificate provided at this path. As it is a self-signed certificate, you need to use the curl hyphen K when connecting to it. Right, let's put this to test. We'll try and connect to these um, endpoints directly. Okay, it's working. And now to the HTTPS endpoint. So since it is self-signed, the case which is already given here, V4 webos, all right, so they have already clearly said that it is using the self-signed uh, default uh, certificate generated by the TLS, and we could confirm that by using uh, by looking at this one that says server certificate, and the CN says Kubernetes ingress controller fake certificate. So if we don't have any certificate, Kubernetes will issue uh, a self-signed certificate which have the CN called uh, Kubernetes Ingress Controller Fix Certificate. All right, so the task is to make sure we use this TLS key and TLS uh, CRT file uh, that is already uh, given in this path. So let's go there. So we do see the TLS cert and TLS key given here. Let's see if we are able to see the TLS cert. Yes. So if we use OpenSSL, I have an X509. TLS.CRT output as I think I need to look up the command here. Open SSL X509. Just display the text form of a certificate so that we know the. Uh, just no out text. In. T-E-X-T, all right. So this is the certificate given. If we look at the CN of the given certificate, it says secure ingress.test. So, which means once we have uh, done or complete the task, which is given to us, 
we should be able to get the CN here instead of this Kubernetes ingress controller fake certificate we should be able to see the secure dash ingress dot test in the CN name so that's what we are trying to achieve part of this question so how to do that uh, go back to the Kubernetes documentation ingress TLS and search for TLS. So it's all about um, making an additional config. Here uh, in the existing ingress. So even before we go to this section, we have to make sure we create a secret uh, of type TLS and then reference this uh, TLS secret in the existing ingress. Let's do that. So first let's create uh, the secret of CLS um, in the team pink namespace. Let's create a secret of type TLS and let's name it as TLS secret and we'll use the key, which is the tls.key in the current directory. And the cert, which is the tls.crt in the current directory. Let's verify the secret again, if that is created. So get secret. TLS secret, it's created. Um, let's examine the content just to make sure. So we clearly see the TLS certificate and the content is already there. And we see the TLS key and the content. So secret is successfully we have successfully created secret now it's all about editing editing the ingress i think ingress name is secure yes so in the spec section let's steal it from here So it's a TLS host, and uh, we know the host name is going to be this one, which is secure ingress.test. And the secret name, the one that we created, is TLS secret and TLS host okay there is, should be a space here and then And then the secret name. Let's check if it looks. All right, looks good. Let's save this ingress. Perfect. So let's do the curl looks good well, let's check it without the verbose to see if it is responding yes looks good 
let's do the same thing here perfect so whoa, what we have to check here is the cn for the server certificate so now it has changed to secure test ingress dot test instead of the kubernetes uh, auto generated self-signed fake certificate so that's it for this question um, thanks for your time.